Now, if you excuse me, mister, I'm going to do a Germany 4.3 lineup. Oh, is this a 4.7 lineup? Hold on. <gasps> the Puma. No, they can't have done this to me. I can't believe it. They nerfed the pack Puma. Germany suffers. How could you do this, Gaijin? Why must you bully... G Seriously, this is at 4.7. The Tigers are 5.3. <laughs> this is basically Tiger confirmed. I can't believe it. So they put this to 4.7. I didn't realize that. So my 4.3 lineup can't have this no more. Dang it. PVKV2. Oh, sweet mobile. Yeah, I wasn't paying attention to the beach at all. Hold on, I might just be able to drive over this here. Wish me luck, everyone. Whee! No, 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 no! Wait, 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 wait! Yes! Tactical. Rush that fucker, he can't take out all of us. Oh, it's the fucking Swedes! I hate Sweden! Gaijin, just remove Sweden from the game. The whole tech tree, just poof, overnight gone. Oh, this is actually one of the vehicles I requested Gaijin to add, and then they actually did. Not because of me. Okay, took him out. Oh, oh wow, we are being proper strafed. <laughs> Smartest American pilot. Okay, two enemy planes spotted. Maybe three. Three enemy planes spotted. Two I'm not scared about, but the third one that's above me, I don't like that. Oh. They've got massive air supremacy. I think I'm counting five planes now. And there's that one there. Where I'm going to try and get the height advantage on at least. I don't know if he spotted me. I don't think he has. We have most of the zones. Ah, fuck it. I'll leave him be. I've got bigger fish to fry. That one is not much of a threat, but it's a kill. Like an easy kill. Oh shit, no no no, I was I thought he wasn't gonna spot me. I did a bad maneuver, bad maneuver, bad maneuver. There he is. Okay, at least um, mm, yeah. Okay. Actually, I'm about to fall onto his six now. Whoa! Oh, almost hit a friendly. Okay, that's three plane. Did I just take out three planes now? Yeah, wait, there was one. He's near B. Enemy have okay, good. He turned away from me. He didn't see me. Easy. It's a heavy fighter. Easy kill coming up. Swedish. Kill him. Kill him. Swede dead. Swede dead. I repeat, Swede dead. It's okay. Let's get an ace. We're about to get a Focke Wolf 190 ace. If I don't kill my pilot with the G's, come on, turn, 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 turn. He doesn't know I'm here. Shit. Ah, fuck it, I just want to get the kill. Wasn't able to turn tight enough. Is there someone on my six, or is that just a tail gunner going ham? Yep, there's someone on my six. Damn it, we just got four kills.
Ah, dang it. This is the German Normandy fighter pilot experience. It was me and one other fighter plane versus like seven allies or something. Their numbers, brother, they know no end. Now I can't spawn in there, I can't spawn in the AA, yeah, I might as well spawn in a church or at least be a giant block of unmovable stuff. Really good traversal and elevation on this gun. Oof, I was really close to getting a hit with that. <gasps> Holy shit! Jesus! <sighs> Holy shit! <laughs> that is what 2,000 hours of War Thunder looks like. 2,000 hours of War Thunder paid off for that shot where I couldn't actually see him. But I knew, like, the lead roughly. And remember, I kept on saying this entire time, you miss 100% of the shots you don't take. That's why. <sighs> Holy shit, someone clipped that. Clip that in the 4K Twitch 60 FPS. With an armor-piercing round as well. Not even hate you, just armor-piercing to the skull. In the, the, like, this is almost accurate enough to be like, I am using aimbot and uh, building seafood stuff. <laughs> you know it's a compliment when people accuse you of hacks. And I hope they accuse me of hacks. I'm like, yes. I've been firing off like rounds left, right and center all game. Just me being like, yeah, yeah, you miss all the shots you don't take. Actually doesn't miss one. Oh man, that gave me a high. You know what, Hex? Fuck Tarkov. All my homies play War Thunder. See, I got excitement without the big shattering. Uh, I lost my gear. Uh, I died to bullshit. Where? I spent 40 minutes in the zone and achieved nothing. Fuck Tarkov. All my homies play War Thunder. Saying War Thunder is more fun than Tarkov is like saying CBT is more fun than bone breaking. <laughs> you see people like, War Thunder makes me sad. War Thunder suffer. No, play Tarkov. My mind is now calloused after playing Tarkov. I, I I gained like a six pack after playing Tarkov just from the f from the pure stress of sitting down to play Tarkov. I have now gained a six pack for all the tensing that my core muscles had to do in that game, and yet I just ended up really fucking depressed. So now when I play War Thunder, I feel real fucking happy. British people in the Churchill travels faster than twenty four kilometers per hour. Oh shit! That was not meant to bounce. It's just a Jackson. There we go. Fuck your transmission. Look. Look at that reverse speed. The peak of British reversing. I right, when did the, since when the Jacksons have armor? I thought they're like M10s. He's got to repair, luckily. He had a yellow breach! What? He had a damaged breach! And it was just an M10! What? Excuse me? It was an M10! Not even a Jackson! And my rounds are bouncing off it! What? Oh shit. Reverse, 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 reverse. Dang it. Okay, watch me. I'm gonna do the same mistake as. Uh... Ah, come on! Angle. There we go. There we go. Wow, so I went for his front armor, but I didn't go for his side armor. I bounced off the side, I penned his front. We live in a society, don't we? Aim for the low plate. Okay, just penetrate through the upper plate, angled and everything, why not? Super Hellcat! Kind of sounds like a Japanese, you know, arcade game startup screen. And he went through my front armor, which was only half angled. Oh shit, that's an enemy. 
Now keep that in mind. So they've got three enemies up at the moment. Hey, I got the kill. Nice. Actually, there he is. There he is. Come on, fucker wolf. You're known for your climbing rate. Climb. Oh, I tried. I didn't put enough hurt on that B-17, which is now dropping stuff. It's always the P-47. It's always. Plane, and it's going to be at slow arc soon. There's also a fighter bomber somewhere. Right there. Got him. Now, where's the heavy fire? That was a good flick fire by me, though, to hit that fighter going past, but that's why I really wanted high rate of fire guns. Okay, good. Now there's another fighter around here somewhere. Oh, nice! It was just a locust. I thought it was a KV-1 or something. Stuka, I hope it's on our side. It should be with the German team. Good job, Stuka. You didn't get a kill, but it looks cool. Two Stukas! Wow! Feels like a cutscene almost in the game. I think that's a friendly Stuka that got shot down. Oh, it's a KV-2 that just hit me. And that's a T-34 that's going to finish off. Take out his tracks. Okay, at least I almost took out his tracks with my dying breath. Oh, I might be able to get the slip on him here. Just don't turn too tightly. Fuck you. Oh, the F4F still somehow managed to get a kill. Do you ever have those games where you just really feel like you're fighting uphill? <laughs> The whole game. Like, bro, I'm doing my best here. And this time I actually do get to say I was doing my best. When you get to be number one on the team and you lose, you do get to say you're trying your best fighting uphill. That was a tough one, but that was a good game. I like this BR, it's fun. Let's try that one more time. Yes, aircraft destroyed. I loved it. Oh. Hold on. Oh, it's a P-47. He's got a long time to wind up. Fuck you. Fuck. Fuck. How unlucky I am today. Oops. I'm dumb. I thought he was further away. I can still land. Oh, I lost the gear, actually. That's going to be tough to land without blowing up. And at the time I turned around, he's already coming after me now. He peeled off now for base AA. Right, let's try and get ready for a landing. But dang it, I don't care that he destroyed the wing, I care that he destroyed the gear. <laughs> yeah, Luf insert Luftwaffe joke here. I can't really do flaps either, because asymmetric flaps. Whoop, whoop. Pull up. Pull up. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on, gently, 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 gently. Uh, gently. Hmm, two enemy fighters on. Let's climb at 300 kph, so we, you know, really shadow climb, but we get some altitude. Hey, I mean, what game would you like more? Conquest or Battle? I think it's Conquest, the one with the capture points. Even though it ends more quickly, I prefer the dynamicness of capturing A, B, and C. Oh, I thought he was going down. Oh, fucking Yankee Doodle and his armor piercing rounds. Although it's a Chinese plane. Aging off. Dang it, dang it, dang it. I just took off again. Agent fire out, returning to base. I just took off again. The.
Uh, he's down for the count. I just took off! And now I'm already landing again! At least gear and flaps are working. <laughs> it really do be Germany in 1945. This is a little bit too close to home in this one. Attention to the map. The authentic experience. Very historical. What do you reckon? Do you reckon I'll get going for more than a minute before I get shot down again? We need to climb now. I think that might be a P8. Two enemy bombers. We don't have many cannons and I need to climb now. At least the BF-109 has one good thing and that's the ability to climb. I have a feeling that's a P8 that just dropped a nuke. So we'll go for the other one now. And the trick is for P8s, just take them head on. They've only got light machine guns head on, and you might be lucky and kill the pilot and co-pilot. It's a Fab 5000, I reckon. Don't stay behind him. Okay, we hit that bomber. Do you remember that film about... Uh, it's a short indie film or like CGI film. Oh, he's heading us on. Yep, that was a P-8. Ouchie. Do you remember that short film about like machines made by man continuing to fight even though all humankind has been wiped out? And it's just AI-controlled aeroplanes still fighting. And it kind of feels like I'm just fighting back the waves of these gigantic fortresses. He's just trying to spray move his uh, rear 20mm cannon. I don't know if I'll even be able to catch up. The plane's quite banged up. The engine is fine, but when control surfaces are damaged, it in increases drag and slows you down a lot. We are catching up though. I've got some cannon rounds left. Yep, we took him down, I think. No, he's dodging. There, maneuver. There we go. I love it when they do that maneuver when they pull back on the stick and just give you a nice juicy target. Unfortunately, both PE8s drop their bombs though. And there you go, there's the mission failed. Cutting the power now. Dive brakes on. Listen to this. Attention to the designated grid zone. Don't worry, we still got one bomb left. Sorry, I'm sad as well. <laughs> That's just kind of sad. I took out an Italian fighter, the RE2000. A BR-1 high right just for two MG-34s. Checking the skies, relatively clear. Let's go for C. Yep, there's two of them if they stay close together. If my siren doesn't spook them off, we're about to get a lot of kills. No dive flaps in this one, so we're going to do it shallow. No, yep, they're splitting. That's annoying. Yes! I almost blew him into the lake. And now we just return to base. <sighs> this is what it feels like to be me. Free! There are now three enemy fighters. One, two, three. And I just spawned in and let's see how many of my team members are in planes. Oh, just me in a dive bomber. <gasps> a fighter! Alright, is is the deal. Can you take out all three enemy planes, please? Cheers. Oh, there's four enemy fighters! 
There is four enemy fighters! <laughs> I'm fighting for my life out here. This is near suicidal, but I got the bomb. I may as well drop it if I can. <laughs> I like this comment. Haha, <laughs> you're fucked, Lamo. <laughs> I'm fighting for my life. Uh, fuck off. Uh.